Okay, let's have a look. We've done pretty much everything else here. What's going on outside? Oh, we didn't find the secret in there. But I have a fear. Oh, it's there. That's it. Oh, that's right. We just... Uh, it was only yesterday. We just beat... Um, what's her face? The second sister. And halfway through the fight, we fell through this bit. It was scripted. And uh, BD1 shut the door, or the, the laser door thing, and she couldn't get to us, and then there was a story. Alright, Cold Dog. Enjoy your Friday. Found it. it feels different than the other tomb. I don't know. I don't like it. it feels different because it's raining inside. Okay. Four chests, two secrets. I'm banking on we're learning force pull. Wait, did I say two chests, four secrets? Four chests, two secrets? I don't know. Um, is there stuff to grab hold of there? Unless we're going to run around that wall. Oh, okay. <laughs> Idiot pads. I found it. <laughs> but. See her. Why didn't you tell me? Because she's a liar. You. How? I rerouted communication the moment you tried to contact her. Slicing encrypted transmissions was always a pastime of hers. She taught me once. There's no technique Sarah has that I haven't perfected. Oh. oh, nice. While it was true that the Empire was closing in on the tomb of Mictrol, Cal rushed to Zepho to find himself caught in a trap laid by the second sister. She revealed herself to be Trilla, Sears' former Padawan. After a perilous battle, Trilla seemed to get the upper hand on Cal, but before she could strike him down, BD1 intervened, positioning an unbreakable laser field between Trilla and Cal. As Cal escaped into Mictral's tomb, he tried to call Sear, but was interrupted by Trilla slicing his comm. Trilla is the second sister, so she's the one that we first, um, that was trying to get everyone at the Bracca salvage uh, shipyard. Why didn't you? Need assist. Why is that not? Oh, we've got to pull this one out. Oh, hang on. Okay, 
So I went to push the core like we're supposed to and nothing happened. I'm thinking it's a different enemy. Uh, so yes, she is an Inquisitor, one the second sister one. Um, but we first heard about Trilla as uh, Seer, the lady who was a Jedi that's been taking us around. Uh, Trilla was her Padawan and things went down. Okay, tactical guide, Zepho. When glowing, power core may be removed with external force. Yeah, but we couldn't remove it. So I'm thinking it needs a, it needs to be pulled out, not pushed out. Which means we'll have to like fight this tomb guardian fair and square. Ugh. people complaining about the movement and the gameplay like I love the platformy stuff now I wonder if we make ourselves known to this stormtrooper if he would shoot at us or if he'd keep shooting at the tomb guardian guardian now guess not help me BD oh they just absolutely nullified by force stuff yep oh not completely Packing a punch. Hey, well done, this man. Force is good today. We only just only just started. I'm playing some BattleTech earlier on. I had a um, I had a one game of Tharsis yesterday, or the day before, can't remember. Um, got everyone to Mars. Didn't have to have one one cannibal session at all. <clears throat> I. I I got my strategy thinking on and uh, tried stuff and it worked. Oh, oh look up there. Can't look at the hollow map when you're swinging, it's kind of cool, but. <laughs> the 
It's gonna be around there. I wonder if we can just get through the door without fighting it. In fact, I think we were in that hallway. Sometimes the uh, the passive approach is best. Stay back, get Four chests, two secrets. Yeah, yeah, we've already fought them, but these ones um, seem to be a little bit stronger. I think maybe there's... I can't... We'll have to have a look at their back. This ball looks broken. Yeah, I mean, we can't force on it. So we're going to have to get a different ball. Oh, well, there's one up there. Yeah. I'm betting that this is where we learn force pull from. And I wouldn't be surprised if there's a locking mechanism on his back. That stops us from pushing that energy ball out. So we have to, like, use the, the force pull to get it, get it out the front. Up, Beatty. My friend, these devices appear oh. to simulate this planet's gravitational pull. I can't help but see it as a motif. We can, um... Oh, it's got no power now. Pants, you broke it. Oh, I broke it. Oh, wait, there's another one. I don't know where to put them though. Oh nice, we've got a meditation point. <clears throat> I think this was the meditation point we saw from the um Oh I might as well um Might as well rest. I love the whole. Yeah, it's got that very sort of You're Tomb Raider y. Of time. For what? My scouts located an artifact of interest at the rear of this tomb. Even now I'm studying it, learning his secrets. 
It seems Cordova was rather taken with these Zephyr. Perhaps enough to hide the Holocron amongst their bones. Yeah, we'll see how much you learn. That's Trilla. What? Step back, I've got this. We've got this. Dude, the best thing is if one of them is talking <clears throat> when that blaster hits them, their their voice cuts out immediately, like mid word. Whoa. If you can kill a stormtrooper with that. There's a tomb guardian. So one of the things we don't know is this a is this a, a tough tomb guardian or an easy tomb guardian? Part of me wants to go up in there and touch it, but, you know. Oh. Well, I mean, now we can with, um, like, immunity, right? Oh, except all the, if we do, all the dudes in the other room come back. Is that a problem for us? No, they're on a lower level. We're never getting across this gap. Better double back and tell the squad. I need one of those things. <gasps> oh. I want to learn the stuff. You just gotta get far enough away for it. You don't, you know, you wanna to stand too close to the picture. <gasps> oh, wait, wasn't I was, uh, I was gonna go up through in these, and I got distracted by this area. I mean, we're going to head back there anyway, right? Right? Oh, wait, look around first. What can we see? We can see some idiots over there. We saw them before. Oh, 
I wonder if we get to them through, like... That's the start. They're, like, through there. Or are they up here? They're before the start? No, the start is there. They're above the start. Right, so they're, like, up higher there. Cool. Right, like that's what we're doing. We're jumping across to here. Yeah, okay. Mind helping me out? That's so much better. Soldiers breach this tomb every minute. Afraid to face me yourself? Had your droid not intervened, I would have killed you with ease. It's okay, buddy. Just ignore her. Yeah, but he did intervene. Because we're, we're a team. Look at these idiots getting wrecked. Ooh. That's cool. Now what is it used for? And does that guy have a sniper rifle? We could probably run across the side of those walls. Or climb around them. Okay. Oh, it's a flamer? Thing automatically def Back up, I've got this. I bet he runs away from us. Well, we have to stop him. I could take him myself. Yeah. Up now. Yeah. You're getting lucky. <laughs> You're getting lucky. I agree, World's Ugliest Man. Like, there's so much, like, climbing and, like, just, you know, from, like, ropey stuff on the side of walls or from pipes hanging. And I, I just think they nailed it. And the fact that, like, the really big beast enemies will, will one and two shot you. Because that's what would have happened in the in the universe, right? Um, and the Jedi didn't go around. I, I can't remember who said it, but like Jedi just didn't go around being a murder hobo on all the animals for no reason. They avoided, you know, that sort of confrontation because you know it's meaningless. Like it's like if <clears throat> just if you can get around him, go around him. Getting out of here alive. Who is that? <clears throat> I was about to say is someone in a in a <clears throat> like a TIE fighter or something in here. 
How did they get... Oh, I see. I see. Alright, bro. It's you and me. Discipline, you will perish. <laughs> oh, that's cool that we bring that back out here. <gasps> I'm really liking that controlled strike, but man, it's it's that part of the gameplay is really cool like you you strike and then you see how he's holding it back you've got to wait and then you just push it again oh that, i missed it and he goes through with that one and then you can get another one and then another one um but like i said yeah it, it, you have to be controlled with it but you just sort of want to you know and start swinging it around and that's when you miss a lot it's it's you you should be here I wasn't expecting you to be there. <laughs> I don't think we're going to be able to jump up on here. Yeah, surprise! Get wrecked! Oh, you get wrecked. Nice. Part of a workforce that helped construct this tomb. They died before the job was finished. And unironically got buried in the tomb that they died building. Yeah. Oh, that was a secret as well. Nice. Love it. Is it going to get him? I'd laugh if it won. Oh. Planned really nicely. Oh, 
Like, it's not, like, overly complex and nor stupidly simple. It's just got a really good balance. <clears throat> Freaking Phylax, man. against the goats. 